What's going on everyone? It is Joe DeLorme where I am back with another video. I know it's been a while since I put out a video, but I want to talk about something I see a lot on YouTube. I see a lot of videos out there that talk about one week green ups or quick green ups and things like that. But I want to talk about my own lawn and why my lawn right here behind me has been this green for two months now. So let's get started. So I want to talk about why my lawn right here, it's literally been this green for about two months now. And I talked about that in the intro, but as you guys know, and if you haven't been watching my channel, you know that I've put down two applications so far this year. I put down a granular at the beginning of the year of in the beginning of April and the beginning of May, I put down a liquid. I'll talk about the liquids in a second. And that's it. That's all I've put down. Just two applications, that's it. One granular, one liquid, and it's been consistently green. And the reason why I bring that up in today's video is I see all the time, especially this time of the year, you'll see a lot of videos out there about one week green ups, or my lawn got this dark in you know seven days, things like that. And a lot of that has to do with what the ingredients are in your bags and things like that. But when you want a consistent green up or a consistent green color in your lawn, like I've seen here behind me, I rather see that, you know, I mean, a lot of those ingredients in those bags, they'll last, you know, a little bit and, and then, you know, that green kind of fades away and then you got to put down another application, but my lawn has been thriving. It's been growing and it's looking really good. And again, only two applications. So with plant specialty, it's a six round system. And the second application of the year is a liquid fertilizer application. So what we have right here are the two liquids that I threw down. So the first liquid I have right here this in this little bottle is their microfuel. It's a 100 analysis. It's a basically a micronutrient liquid. At that rate, I threw down at three ounces per 1,000. And then the big bottle right here is their 1803. This is their macrofuel. So their macro fuel, it's a great product. There's no phosphorus, which is great because I don't need phosphorus in my soil from my soil test. So with the macro fuel, I threw down 0.05 pounds of nitrogen in my sprayer. So with the 0.5 pounds of nitrogen, it came to about 30 to 33 ounces per 1,000 square feet of their macro fuel. So again, I threw that in my sprayer, sprayed it out in my yard. I let it sit overnight. And then the, the next morning, I, I watered everything in nice and deep and again, this is my lawn right here. Two applications this year, nice dark green. I'm super happy. So speaking of the backpack sprayer I use, this is what I use. I use this for over a year now and I absolutely love it. This is the Spraymate. This is their Tornado model. It's a four gallon backpack sprayer. It is a very easy DIY friendly backpack sprayer. I've done a full review on this backpack sprayer in the past. I'll leave that link below to that video and go check them out. I'll leave a link to the product below. It's a very affordable backpack sprayer and I've had really good success with it. I sprayed iron. I sprayed these products right here, the macro and the micro fuel. I sprayed a uh, biostimulants with this in the past and I've had really good success with this backpack sprayer. I even used it for my lawn paint in the winter time um, and it worked really great. I, I can't speak highly enough of this. Flowzone is actually the parent company of Spraymate. It actually says it on the battery, uh, Flowzone. So go check them out. Uh, people that have bought the sprayer from watching my videos, they really do love this backpack sprayer. So go check it out. If you wanna get into spraying liquids, things like that, this is a great beginner entry model that's very affordable compared to a lot of the other brands that are out there. So that's pretty much it for today's video. I just wanted to go over that, you know, it's not always about how many products you are using in your yard. It also comes down to the quality of the products and, you know, how well they perform. You know, a lot of people out there, they're gonna, they're gonna use a ton of different products. They don't even know if some of those products, what they're doing to their lawn. Um, and I can honestly say that that's all I've used this year, a granular from the same company and two liquids from the same company, and that's it. That's all I've used. Other than wheat, some weed control, I've used some herbicides to clean up some areas of my lawn, that's it. And you could see, I mean, the color, I think the color, it honestly speaks for itself. And, you know, just think twice of what you're using. You know, a lot of people, they don't know what those products, like I said, are doing. As you can see, I know what these products are doing and they're working really great. And this is the side of my house over here, just to give you guys a quick update of the side of the house and everything's looking really great. It's really thick. I mean, the turf is thick. 
I talk about it all the time. Are you gonna have problem areas? Yes, nobody's perfect. Even some of those people that have those big high drone shots and things like that, and they show their stripes and everything, which is great. But if you zoom in enough, you'll see there, there will be problem areas. And they'll, sometimes they'll admit to it. You know, they'll have, you know, certain things like POA and, you know, POA Trivialis and things like that in their yard. And guess what? I'm not ashamed to say that my lawn's not perfect, but guess what? It's green. And that's great and it's thick it's healthy and i couldn't be happier i'm gonna i just can't wait to hopefully i want to really get this through the summertime hit it with another overseed and just keep it going and you know once you find that particular product that you really love and you really like then things get easy and the only other thing that i will note about my lawn and the greenness is i would say that it comes down to also grassy guys you know i'll, that, I'll talk about that in another video but the grass seed, I think, plays a big factor into your lawn and how healthy that turf is. But I'll save that for another video. But for now, if you enjoyed today's video or if you found today's video helpful, make sure you smash that like button. It really does help out with the channel. If you have any questions or concerns on today's video, leave them down in the comment section below. And again, go check out Plant Specialty, Mike Fabian. Great guy, owner of Plant Specialty. Drop him a DM if you're interested in his products. He will ship them out to you. And again, I'm not affiliated with him in any way. I do not get paid any kind of commission or anything like that. I honestly just really, I just really enjoy the his products in this really nice green lawn. And one more thing, guys, before I leave, go check out my Instagram. Go check out my TikTok. If you're interested in a good laugh, go check it out. From my comments that I get, a lot of people find it funny. So if you're interested in a good laugh, go check it out. Until next time, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.